Oh, you ain't getting no more. I can't really no. taste it. Well, you won't taste it to Thursday. So you can get on. Thursday ain't promise. You know what I'm well, saying? Well, mm -hmm. all right, gang. So here my crawfish head. All right, gang. So yeah, he on the stuff the last head. was it. This is it. That's Mama Jones Cajun crawfish beef, baby. That's Mama Jones way right there. Right, right there. Right, right there. there. Welcome to my kitchen, you guys, and today I'm about to prep my crawfish bisque, y'all. And y'all know Mom Jones don't make the crawfish bisque the regular way. I made it like that one time before, and I don't make it like that. I make it my way. But anyway, I'm peeling my heads, and this is what I'm doing, you guys. So I'm peeling the crawfish. When you can't find the crawfish heads, just the plain heads. Okay, clean crawfish. Okay, when you can't find the plain heads, this is what you do. Take and clean that inside. Break it off. Well, if you got some scissors, just cut it off. So, yeah, this is the crawfish. And this bag of crawfish was like $29, y'all. So you're going to clean that, that meat. You're going to get that up out there, out that tail. And let me show you again the head. You're going to pick all that out. Take you some scissors. Cut the eyes off. Bam. Show y'all one more time. We're gonna peel the tail. See that tail that time everything came out of the watch. See? Alright. But um so with this you're gonna need some cornbread. You can make you some homemade cornbread or you can make you some jiffy cornbread. It don't matter. I like Jiffy, but I add uh, cornmeal to my stuff sometimes, but uh, I don't think I got no cornmeal, so I'm just going to use Jiffy today when I make this, y'all, but I'm going to show y'all how I make my little dressing and stuff, my little heads, so y'all just stay tuned. All right, gang, so I got it peeled. I'm going to save my... Uh, Pause. I'm gonna save my pause because I'm gonna add that to my pot too. But I ain't gonna. I'm gonna add just the big size ones. We ain't finna play around with them little bit of ones. We gonna throw that away. But now I'm finna soak these. I'm finna soak these in some salt water, you guys, because to get that smell and get that freezer flavor smell up out of them. Because I got to make them, you know, do what they do. So then we got to wash these. These are the ones I'm gonna use for the dressing that I create. Stay tuned. Alright gang, so now I'm just finna create my dressing. My little seafood dressing is something real quick that I'm finna create. But in my crawfish bits, I'm gonna do the crawfish tails, you guys. I'm gonna do sausages and I'm gonna do shrimp. But that's how I like mine. So, we are gonna sit that on over there. Cause we might not mess with that till tomorrow, but I'm finna create this here. Let's get this right. Alright. So here I got onion, bell pepper, and garlic in here. I'm finna drop these crawfish tails in here, you guys. And we're gonna blend it on. So we're gonna blend it. We're gonna pre-red because I'm gonna use this to make it as the base for this the meat for my crawfish. But I'm gonna blend it all the way up because it's easier to stuff the shells instead of the crawfish falling out, you know. So I discovered that was more easier for me when I make it, you guys. So, yeah. Let me go ahead and make these. Alright, gang. And I'm going to 
I'm gonna blend it one more time. So make sure we get all that down up in there. Cause that's gonna be the base for this. All right, gang. So I'm trying to make enough for 60 heads. That's why I ain't do that much cornbread. But hopefully, make it do what it do. Here's the shrimp, the crawfish tails, and the seasoning, you guys. So we're gonna go ahead and get this all whipped up. Add my little butter. Add a little creamy mushroom. Cause I'm not making a lot. I'm making a little bit. Some sage. That sage gonna give you that cornbread dressing flavor, you guys. Uh, stay tuned. I'm gonna add a little seafood magic seasoning. I add some onion powder. I mean garlic powder. I'm out of onion powder, you guys. So I gotta go to the stove. And I'm gonna add some seasoning oil. Add so we just gonna that just gonna be a pile of over fifty over sixty you guys. Over 60 heads. Smell good. Okay, stay tuned guys. I need to let my butter finish melting. Stay tuned. Alright gang, so here my crawfish heads. I soaked them in some crawfish ball. Just so they could have a little... You know, flavor into them. So I'm finna drain these, you guys. And I also cleaned them. So yeah, stay tuned. Okay, gang. So I got 60 heads. And this is what I do. I got 58 heads. But this is easier way for me to stuff my heads. Let me show y'all. What I do is take my Crawfish head. I spread the dressing out and kind of smooth, but it's actually cold, so I hope I got enough for these heads. I ain't want to make too much of this. That's the easiest way to fill your heads. I'll be back when I finish filling the heads, you guys. Gang, so yeah, here I'm stuff the last head. When I tell y'all, Mama Jones, I bought that cornbread dressing to the tea. I made just enough. Just enough. All right, so now I'm going stuff them. Stay tuned. All right, gang, so now I'm placing them in a the pan. Because I'm going to bake them for about 15 to 20 minutes. So that cornbread can stick on to these shells, you guys. So I'm going to have a nice little mess. You know what I'm saying? So stay tuned. Alright, gang. So I tell you, I make Mama Jones crawfish bits. Not the original crawfish bits. Mama Jones bits, okay? So here we have the bits. They've been baked, right? We have some crawfish tails. We have some smoked sausage. We have some shrimps. And I'm going to do my claws this time. I don't know I'm going to add them. But since they look, they kind of big, you know, I'm going to go ahead and add them. So, we're going to come on over here, y'all. All right, gang. So, I'm going to start by adding my sausage. So, we're going to... I normally have more sausage than this. But, we're just going to get these little sausage brown on each side you guys so get out the way we're gonna let them just fry a little bit on each side yeah 
head honey. Stay tuned. Alright gang, I'm going to leave just my left head of uh, smoke fashion grease in there. I'm going to add a stick of butter. I'm going to add my onion, bell peppers, garlic, green onion, and celery. That just simmer a little bit. Stay tuned. All right, gang. So now I'm gonna add my tomato paste. And I don't like mine red, red. So. Stirred up up in there like that. Yeah, you know, just like that. We're gonna let this start to doing this thing. A lot of people cook theirs in the oven. I don't, y'all. I cook mine on top of the stove. I ain't got time for all that shenanigans. I think I need to add another stick of butter to this one. Because I normally do uh, uh, two tablespoons of uh tomato sauce. I'm gonna add another stick one more stick of butter y'all. This is how I make mine. This is the Mama Jones one. So we just gonna get it on work the fuck in there. Yes, honey, and that's pure butter. Ooh. Looks like this one might be a little weird, weird. <laughs> I'm gonna hook it up, y'all. All right. Let me get it up. So we're gonna let this butter here just melt. Then I'm gonna come back with a cup of flour. All right, gang, so I got my flour worked up. Now I'm going to add some water. Let's see. And that's a bowl of water. Let me see. Just want to get this cooked, you guys. Once I get it cooked and get it to cooking and break this flour and this tomato sauce down, we're going to come back and add the other ingredients, you guys. I'm going to add my uh, crawfish paws. Okay, gang, so I'm going to add the crawfish paws. Stay tuned. We let this break down, let that flour cook and break down on low. I'm going to add me some garlic powder. Of course, y'all know. Mom Jones add her lifting fat. Just gonna let it just start doing this. Thing. Now we're gonna add some parsley because I like to see the parsley flakes floating around. We'll add some black pepper. Season all. Oh, and you got to add the basil, some bay leaves, you guys. So at least some piece of bay leaves. I'm gonna add them. So I'm just gonna let them 
Just simmer and do its thing, you guys. Stay tuned. All right, gang, here I got a little shrimp that I split in half with a little seasoning on it. A little seafood seasoning on it. I'm going to add my little crawfish tails. That's four packs of crawfish tails, you guys. Y'all see that? Y'all see? Do you see that? Alright, we're going to let this cook a little bit before I add my, my, um, uh, paws. I mean my heads. Stay tuned. Alright, gang. So now I'm going to add my heads. And then I'm going to put the top on it and let it just do its thing. Mm -hmm. And we're going to let it just do its thing, y'all. I'll be back. Stay tuned. Get up out of my kitchen. I am going to come up out of your kitchen. Mm -hmm. Go on, taste it. Ma Why are you talking about you just want to taste it? Just the taste. At least you want to put some rice on no, it. No, I ain't cooked no rice. This is for Thursday. The day is the cool Thursday ain't promised to you. Give me mine now. So it could be put up. Mm-hmm. Go on there. No, I ain't no. I can't no. taste it. Ain't no, no, you can't taste it. No, Go on, get on up out of here. I'll be back. No, you won't. <laughs> Yes, you be gone. No, I ain't. All right, gang. Uh, here's the finished results, you guys. This will be served over some rice. Look Ooh, at yeah. that. Oh, yeah. Give me that. Look at that, y'all. Y'all see it? Yes, honey. I don't know what you know. You ain't getting no more. I can't really no. taste it. Well, you won't taste it to Thursday. So you can get on. I ain't promise. You know I'm well, sick at all. Okay, well you know you won't taste it to thirst. You don't taste it. There you go. You can't have a taste. You man, get up out my kitchen. Goodbye. Goodbye. She won't taste no more of this. Mm -hmm. Might have to take this down the street, round the corner for. Um, <laughs> they put it up somewhere. But yeah, here it is, y'all. Here's the finished results. Yes, honey. This is it. This is it. That's Mama Jones Cajun Crawfish Beef, baby. That's Mama Jones way right there. Right, right there. Right there. Right there. Mm -hmm. You want to taste a little bit? Mm -hmm. I yeah. mean, I taste it. No, y'all ain't finna mess with this here. It's gonna be hell and high waters in this camp for Thursday, y'all. For me to keep them away from my pots. But anyway, gang. Give this video a thumbs up. Like. Share, I'm about to drop this video, then we coming back with the cornbread dressing. We'll subscribe, hit that notification bell on game. Head ass gang, 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 head ass